I am not good at this. I'm not good at asking people for help. That's probably why it's taken me so long to ask for help. But you realize that as a father that there are certain things that you will do to make sure that your children are happy. And if I didn't ask, then I would be failing them as a dad. My pride be damned. So I'm asking for her. As many of you longtime viewers have known, my daughter, Arielle, has uh, cancer. In uh, 2007, she was diagnosed with rhabdomyosarcoma. A, a tumor was growing behind her right eye. It's uh, a very aggressive form of cancer, and the odds of beating it the first time were very, very low. She went through a year of chemo and radiation. Surgery was off the table because it was inoperable. It was too close to too many large blood vessels for surgeons to risk a surgery. After that year, we entered the long stage of having her scanned every three months to see if there was any returning disease, and we got very lucky. For almost three years, there was seemingly no new disease present. And then in February of last year, there was a new tumor in pretty much the same place. It was shortly after I had just started doing live videos on YouTube um, that we got the news. She went in for more radiation, more chemotherapy, the uh, tumor shrank, and then to ensure that there was uh, nothing else in there, she in her nasal cavity, um, in May, she had a dual craniotomy where they opened up her skull to access her nasal passages and clean out whatever else was in there and take any, uh, any biopsies that they couldn't reach conventionally. Then she got an aspergillus infection and then she got a staph infection. And then this last January, they found growths on her brain and on her spine. A third relapse of this type of cancer has no data for survival rate. Um, the doctors have told us that we have months, barring any remarkable um, response to the current treatments. Many people have been asking what it is they can do. Many people feel very helpless in uh, being able to offer her some sort of comfort. Um, there have been a number of things in, work, in the works, but now that we have time pressing on us, there is one thing that she wanted that maybe you guys can help me give to her. So here, in a nutshell, is what we're asking donations for. We're raising money to send Ariel to Hogwarts. She has been a Harry Potter fan. She's grown up with the books. It's the one place she really wants to go. And at this point, even she knows that she may not see it. I realize that it may seem like a frivolous thing to ask for, but not if you're a father. The reason why we can't go to any other charitable donations like Make-A-Wish Foundation or any kind of wish charity is that all of them will only allow one wish per child. So we can't get charitable contributions for this. So that's why we're turning to you guys. Down below is a link to a very old website of mine at www.jason.com. That's Jason with a D, D-G-E-Y-P-S-C-U-N. If you click that, you will see a new home page outlying Ariel's story and what we're asking donations for. At the bottom of that is a PayPal link. Click it, and you can donate any amount you want. We can't do a Kickstarter campaign, mainly because Kickstarter has a set amount, and it takes a certain amount of time, and time is something that we don't have we're kind of in the one more stage. One more birthday. One more summer. 
one more Christmas if we're lucky. Right now, I just want to be able to give her one more time where she can be a kid again, which is something that she has not had in a very long time. I just want her to have a chance to be Ariel. Um, so, if you feel like you want to donate, please go to the website below and click the donate button and donate anything. There is no judgment there. You can donate 50 cents if you want. Um, and that would be greatly, greatly appreciated. And if anyone wants to uh, mirror this video or share it with other people on YouTube, I don't have that wide of a reach. If anyone would like to link to it, that would be greatly appreciated too. Please feel free to spread this plea all over the internet. Thank you, everybody. Until next time, this has been Jason with a D. Hey guys, uh, this is the Hellfire Gamer, and thank you for taking time to watch this video. Uh, hold on, just one second. Okay, so thank you for taking time to watch this video. Um, I saw it when Woody's Gamer Tag re-uploaded it for for this guy. Um, uh, I the reason I'm re-uploading it is because uh, it kind of hits home for me because uh, my cousin he's 17 now, but uh, when he was born, he uh. A couple years after he was born, I'm not really sure how old he was, but he had cancer, uh, and he had like a tumor in like the back of his head, and so um, this I don't really want to go through that whole story because uh, I don't know all the details and things like that. But uh, yeah, so this this just kind of hit home for me, and uh, so I thought I would re-upload it and try to help this guy as as little as I can. I know I can't really do much because I have such a small channel. But um, he, I think I think whatever we can do to help uh, Ariel get to go do what do what she wants with the time she has left, I think it'd be great to be a part of it. So that's why I'm re-uploading this video. So um, if you guys can, uh, there there will be a link in the description below to um, the PayPal he mentioned in the video, the website or whatever. Uh, I, I haven't went to it yet. But uh, if you guys could take some time and uh, have any spare money whatsoever to donate, that would be great. I, I just think it would be amazing to be a part, a part of helping this little girl get to do what she wants while she still has time to do it. So thank you guys and have a nice day.